Hey y'all, I hope you're having a great day. I wanted to try something a little different today. One of my YouTube subscribers, uh, Dragon Mount Fishing, uh, said he would love to see me throw a chug bug in this pond. And uh, gave me a good idea for a new series I think I'm gonna try to do. Uh, I'm gonna do a series where I'm gonna let you guys comment on what baits you want me to throw, and uh, I'm gonna try it. So just uh, leave me a comment below on what bait you wanna see me throw, and I'll, I'll uh, plan on doing that in a future episode. But uh, the bait he wanted me to throw was a chug bug, and I've never thrown a chug bug before. Um, so I thought I'd give it a try. They come in a two inch variety and a three inch. And uh, this is the three inch. And I've never fished one. And uh, so far I'm really impressed with the hooks. The hooks are super, super sharp. And I've fished, uh, I've fished popper baits before, popping frogs. But I've never tried the chug bug, so I'm hoping this is gonna work for me. And uh, make sure you go and check out Dragon Mount's channel. I'm going to leave a link in the description below. So you guys go over there and tell him I sent you over that way. And he's got a lot of good content. And uh, let's see if we can do anything on the chuck bug. This bait does walk really well. Just got to figure out how they want it. If they want me to work it kind of fast or if they want me to pause. Sometimes you just gotta figure out the way the bass want the bait. Oh, I forgot to mention, I've got the baby bass color. When I'm fishing one of these popper style baits, I usually like to give it a couple of pops and then let it sit. A couple more pops. A lot of times when it pauses, they'll go after it. Either right when it pauses or when you make that first pop after the pause, it just drives them crazy. Hmm. Just had a big bass blow up on this bank over here. Let's work this chug bug down the bank and see if we can get it to react. Hmm, there he goes again. Let's get down here a little closer and see if we can get a better cast on him. Okay, had one hit at it, but he missed it. Hey, that's a good sign. I've been fishing maybe 10 minutes. Got a bite. A little while before the topwater bite should be good, so... Still got a pretty good bit of daylight. So if they're hitting it this early, they might really hit it later on. Let's throw back over there again, see if we can get him to bite. He never felt the hook, so he might bite again. Got him that time. All right. Don't know if it's the same one. All right, my first first fish on the chug bug. We got one pair of the hooks. Not a bad fish. He's probably about a pound. There we go. First fish on the chug bug. Don't know if that's the same one that hit earlier or not, so I'm gonna make a couple more casts over here. If we don't get any hits, I'll probably move a little bit. Okay, let's move on down. Sounds like somebody's doing a lot of target practice. Okay, he missed it. Thought he might have had it. Felt like he pulled it underwater, but uh, I think he let go pretty quick. But let's try him again. Okay, I hadn't had any bites over on this side of pond, so I'm gonna go back to where I started. That's where I had most of my bites. And I saw a pretty good one jump over there earlier, so maybe we'll get lucky and get him to bite again. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good one. Stay down. 
Yeah, it's a real good one. All right. Let's get up here where we can work with it. All right, that's a good fish. Real nice one. I'm gonna say he's about two and a half. Let me get my scale. Oh no, he's trying to go down the bank. Can't let him get away. Not yet. It's a nice healthy fish. I thought he was bigger the way he fought. He's strong. Got him unhooked. Let's get a weight on him. Two pounds, six ounces. So right there at two and a half. Good bass. Let's let's get him back. Let's try not to fall in the water. There he goes. This seems to be the spot where all the action's happening, so I'm just gonna probably fish here until dark. I got maybe 20 minutes left. A big one just hit on this bank over here. I have to go over there after I get this cast in. This is over where I caught my first one. So for some reason, there's good bit of bass over here and they're feeding pretty good it looks like oh got him got another one that's a good one too all right that's probably another two pounder Awesome. We'll get a weight on him too. He got he got both the hooks. All right, let's see. Let's see what he weighs. May have to just bring the scale with me. If they keep biting like this. I think he's about two pounds. Let's see. Two pounds, four ounces. A little bigger than I thought. I'm not complaining. There we go. Man, they're really hitting this chug bug good now. One of those days you wish you had some more daylight. Oh no, he missed it. Got my treble hooks all tangled up in my line. Let's throw back out there again. I don't think he got the hooks. All right, last cast. We're about out of daylight. I don't even know if you guys can see anything at this point. All right, we're gonna make one more cast out there. See if he'll bite again. Yep. Oh man, did he go after it? He came out of the water for that one. Pretty good fish, too. <laughs> Maybe not. I thought he was good, but I foul hooked him. He flipped over that bait. Hold on, buddy. I'm about to get you back in the water. Gotta give him an A for effort on that one. Man, that was an aggressive little guy. He may go for about eight ounces, but he came up out of the water. He went airborne for that. Yeah. 
Okay, y'all, I think I'm going to go ahead and call it on that one. It's done got to be pretty dark. There's a little daylight left, but not very much, and it's getting hard to see. Almost went off and forgot my scale. But yeah, I'm pretty impressed with the chug bug. It really, really did good for me today. I think I caught, uh, it's either three or four. I can't remember. I think it's four fish. A couple of them over, over uh, a couple over two pounds. So I'm, I'm always happy about that. It's one of the better days I've had out here in a while. So thank you, Drag Em Out Fishing, for uh, recommending the chug bug. I'm definitely going to add it to my tackle box and keep fishing it in the future. You guys make sure you go check out Drag Em Out. And, uh, well, I'm about to go get a bite to eat. Don't get hungry. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll catch you next time.